Pfeiffer syndrome. Pfeiffer syndrome. A disorder characterized by craniosynostosis, which affects the shape of the head and face. It also includes abnormalities of the hands and feet. Symptoms Craniosynostosis, premature fusion of the skull bones, characteristic facial features. Tura brachycephaly, high prominent forehead. The head is unable to grow normally. Proptosis. Eyes appear to bulge. Hypotellarism. Wide set or an abnormally large distance between the eyes. Maxillary hypoplasia. Underdeveloped upper jaw. Hearing loss. Dental problems. Pollux varus. The thumbs are wide and bend away from the other digits. Hallux varus. The first toes are wide and bend away from the other digits. Brachydactyly. Unusually short fingers and toes. Syndactyly. Some webbing or fusion between the digits. Causes. Mutations of the fibroblast growth factor receptor 1, FGFR1, gene on chromosome 8, or mutations of the fibroblast growth factor receptor 2, FGFR2, gene on chromosome 10. Types. Type 1, classic Pfeiffer syndrome, craniosynostosis, maxillary hypoplasia. Inherited in an autosomal dominant, mostly normal intelligence and a normal lifespan. Type 2, cloverleaf-shaped skull, due to extensive fusion of bones, severe proptosis. Occurs sporadically or not inherited. Severe neurological compromise, generally with early death. Type 3. Craniosynostosis, severe proptosis. Occurs sporadically or not inherited. Severe neurological compromise, generally with early death. All the types have broad thumbs, broad first toes. Brachydactyly, and possibly syndactyly. Treatment. There is no cure. The treatment is supportive. Correcting skull deformities by a series of surgeries often within the first three months after birth. Later, correcting respiratory and facial deformities by surgeries.